Hello everyone, welcome to my YouTube channel, Global Earthly Living. Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, and thank you so much for stopping by uh, to watch this video. And if you're new to this channel, please subscribe and be part of the Global Earthly family. In this video, I'm going to talk about how to deal with menstruation cramps. To those of you who do not know how uh, the menstruation period occurs, uh, a little bit of explanation here. A menstruation occurs when the uterus uh, sheds its lining once a month. And the constructing of the uterine muscles is caused by a substance called prostaglandin. A prostaglandin is secreted by the buildup of the lining and when there is enough prostaglandin uh, the uterus contracts and then the period begins so it is also possible uh, to have both high prostaglandins and some abnormality in the reproductive organs which can cause you to feel uh, much pain when you have your periods so the condition of having painful periods is called painful menstruation or you can call it menstrual cramps or still you can call it uh, the seminaria. Menstrual cramps can be divided into two. There is what we call primary dysmenorrhea and secondary dysmenorrhea. A primary dysmenorrhea is this uh, mild pains which you can experience when you have your uh, menstruation periods. And the secondary dysmenorrhea is when this pain is too much that it can hinder you from going to work or it can stop you from going to school and this pain can be caused by some underlying medical conditions so it's very important darling if you have so much pain during your menstruation periods to go and visit a doctor responsible for women affairs one thing you have to know is that uh, this secondary dysmenorrhea can be associated with underlying medical conditions such as fibroids it can be inflammatory disease it can be sexually transmitted diseases it can be ovarian cysts or tumors or it can be endometriosis so it is very important if you experience so much pain during your period to go and visit a doctor in some women uh, they experience uh, heavy menstrual bleeding this heavy menstrual bleeding is often associated with imbalance of sex hormones it can be thyroid glands malfunction or it can be blood coagulation disorders so if you have very heavy menstrual bleeding please go visit a doctor for help so uh, how do you reduce painful uh, menstrual periods uh, number one you can reduce uh, painful menstrual periods uh, by controlling the production of prostaglandin with the help of a diet with the foods containing um, number one omega-3 uh, fatty acids and such foods can include fish oil uh, flax seed it can also be foods like walnuts another way of uh, controlling the production of pr prostaglandin is by eating a uh, tomatoes pink grapefruits apricots gravel it can be pineapples it can also be a ginger uh, according to research ginger has been found uh, to be 
very effective as ibuprofen for relieving menstrual cramps so if you can grab some few uh, pieces of ginger or ginger powder and use it it can very much help you to reduce menstrual cramps there are other ways also to reduce menstrual cramps and this include exercising regularly please ladies go out there and exercise it will help you to reduce uh, menstrual cramps you can use heat and when i say heat uh, i mean that you can soak yourself in a hot bath or uh, you can use a heating pad and lay it on your low abdomen you can as well use a hot water bottle or a heat perch on your low abdomen or on your back this can help you to ease uh, the menstrual cramps another way you can do it is to reduce stress stress is one of the things that make um, menstrual cramps so severe so please ladies have some techniques of managing or reducing your stress if you want to have uh, less painful uh, menstrual periods another way is to avoid excessive intake of salts you can as well get adequate rest uh, it is very important for you to drink much fluids drink as much as possible this can help you to control menstrual cramps another tip is to massage your abdomen you can reduce on the amount of food you eat and try to eat uh, nutritious meals and you can practice relaxation techniques or you can join yoga you can as well take anti-inflammatory uh, over-counter drugs uh, such as ibuprofen for several days before you expect your periods and if you're having very heavy periods uh, you can relieve the pain and reduce this much uh, bleeding uh, by applying a high pack on the low abdomen for not more than 15 minutes this can help you to reduce a blood loss and then make you feel a little bit better and if these are painful and heavy periods continue please go to the doctor it's very important it can be that maybe you have a, a handling medical condition that needs to be treated uh, thank you so much for watching this video and please don't forget to subscribe give it a thumbs up share and comment see you in my next video